my name's Dr. Seed. I'm going to be taking you all the way back to where biofuels begin. My first question was, can we identify these different seeds? First up, we have corn, which can be popped. Our mission today is to um, plant these and see if over the few weeks we can grow these. you're going to start to see that there's lots of parallels in the design that we have as humans, the things that we are trying to replicate and we're copying from biology. Um, today um, we are um, making flowers out of plasticine and we're going to make an animation so it looks like the flower is growing. I'm enjoying the class and I'm looking forward to um, seeing the animations. I'm learning how to grow algae and um, I'm learning about biofuels. We're trying to make a photobioreactor, just using things that you would find in like every normal household. Basically what we have is a cereal box as the container, which is going to be the reactor itself. We're going to try and deliver CO2 and light to it, so the container is see-through. We're going to try and make CO2 within the container by mixing uh, bicarbonate of soda and an acid. We have some algae to stick in, to, so it's, hopefully it will grow. I've made some food for the algae and a pump to recirculate the CO2 through from the air into liquid and fruit. We are making collages of um, algae uh, when looking through a microscope. There's pictures here of algae under a microscope and we're going to like, try and copy them and make our own. The main thing you get from algae is lipids. And lipids can be converted into biodiesel and they can be run in any form of engine. We've been making very simple kind of batteries using lemons, trying to get an LED to light up. And we've built models of our own floating cinemas. You should all have a little light bulb. Yeah. yeah? And a little white holder that you put your light bulb into. Yeah. And then you're going to have a thing with a red wire and a black wire. And it's got little clips on the end of it, okay? And that connects to your black battery pack. And you want to screw that bulb in and you should see it light up like that, okay? So that's going to go inside our little model photo cinema. We need to both come up with solutions for and implement that energy mix that's going to make up the energy of our future society and biofuels are going to be a really important part of that. You can see this little bit here, this is where the fuel just went in. So all of the engine and the working parts of the boat, they're all down here, so they're underneath everything. 